Here's a drink. Three, 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 three. Oh wait, it's thirty, three, 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 thirty, three. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. Hello, game guy, cooler, and ranger. Good lord, 33 months in a row, holy crap, my guy, thank you so much, I appreciate it. Seriously, wow. I am blown away, my god! And it all started with Halo. Yes, yes, it did. So, yes, hello, everyone. Uh, yeah, uh, we're we're gonna we're gonna play Bloodborne too. Why not? <laughs> and I don't see why why not. It just came out here, uh, like back on back on the eighth. <laughs> it, oh, hello, Meiji. How are you doing? Uh, it, it, it hasn't been made by FromSoft, and it, it goes by a different name, but, uh... It, 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 you know... You know... Let's, let's just get right into it. Oh my god, it's loud. <laughs> There we go. So, I, I don't know a whole lot about it, by the way. <laughs> Music is fantastic so far. How's the audio for you guys? Is it loud? There we go, 
I think that's a bit better. How are you doing, Meiji? It's rare you come by when we're alive. Being busy and all that. Uh, video. That is all, all good. All, all good. Yep. All right. Let's just get right into it. Funny how there's no, you know, title screen or anything like that. It's Saturday, I don't have to leave for work yet. Ah. Uh -huh. Ooh. Oh, pardon. You know, actually, I think I'm in no mood for games right now. Huh? How much longer are we to be kept here? Or we just simply watch as Paris burns from afar? The rabble are rioting. This is the price to be paid for spoiling the masses. You don't understand, Gabrielle. The king sent us here long before the city went up in flames. He knew what was about to transpire. I think he is somehow involved in these events. Oh, come now, Marie. True, he can be misguided and somewhat short-tempered at times, but he's no Nero. Then why have we been given no news for so long? Place on for Gabrielle. The children. They'll soon be out of harm's way. I am most certain of it. Monsieur Clary will take good care. I don't know anything about this game, by the way. At least we are safe. Safe, Vraiment. Where are the Chateau Guards? We are still protected. Ow. The king just prefers. Thanks. Hello, Meth. How are you doing? <laughs> sort of guard. Ooh. Guards or jailers? They won't even let us leave this room, Gabrielle. The king. He has lost his mind to grief. First, our darling Sophie. Then our beloved son. My poor sweet angel. They didn't let me say goodbye. I wasn't even allowed to see him. Aww. See if I, something inside me is, is crying out. Telling me he's still of this world at, at times. I think I hear him calling to me. I'm so afraid. What do you fear, my queen? Everything. Everything. All right, and all as usual. Hope you're doing good and so does chat. I can relate, Mev. Army of indefatigable automats that Monsieur de Vaucanson has built for him. The charlatans who advise him, who are now more powerful than ministers. What happened to my son? What will happen to the children that God has deigned to leave in my care? I won't let any harm come to them. This I promise you. But how? Do you not see that we're prisoners here? All is not lost. You forget about the one automat that is not hostile to Seems us. like it, Mev. This new bodyguard of yours. Oh shit, we get to customize her? Okay. Ooh. Gold. Bronze. Marble. I really do like the black, though. I didn't expect we would get to customize her, actually. <laughs> Very cool. I'm going to go with this one. Hair. Uh... I'm thinking this one. Burn everything to the ground for me. <laughs> I will do my best. Now, what should the body be made out of? I do like the black. Uh, but I don't know if I should go with like... Uh, maybe something more akin to normal skin color. 
I don't know. What do you think, chat? What kind of material should she be? Gold doesn't age. <laughs> I mean, no. <laughs> the marble highlights all the symbols on her a lot more. Oh, God. Look at all the moving parts on her as well. Wow. This is really well animated and modeled, might I say. Like, wow. Seeing the pattern looks cool, too. Yeah, we can't really do that with gold. Or black. Or the completely white one. I'd say the marble one, like, highlights the symbols the most. Maybe we should go with that. Oh! Your classes? <laughs> Heavy weapon special move block. Petrification grenade. Projectiles that temporarily immobilizes enemies. Okay. Here's a drink. Booyah. Booyah. Hello, Halo. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I'm just noticing. Ho hold on. Hold on, chat. Give me just a moment here. I'm noticing something. Just a moment. Weird. Very, very weird. Uh huh. Uh, interesting. I noticed it didn't throw anything at me, by the way, when the subs came in. I'm trying to see if I can fix that. Is there a way to fix that? I don't know. Everything seems to be in order. Huh. Weird. Oh well. Uh, I, I don't know how to fix it. Sorry. Anyway, uh, uh, let's see here. Shield. Bodyguards rely on their strength to withstand hits and deal heavy physical damage to enemies. Durability plus 3, it increases health and balance. And engineering plus 2, increases armor and effectiveness of alchemical afflictions. And the chance of finding loot. The soldier. Uh, ranged attack. Projectiles that can knock over an enemy. Okay. Strong fighters that wield heavy weapons and perform phys more powerful physical attacks. Okay. Dancer. Oh my god. <laughs> Dancers are highly resilient and can chain attacks together in quick succession to immobilize enemies and inflict critical hits. Essentially a rogue, I assume, then. And the alchemist. Wild that neutralizes enemy alchemical attacks. Alchemist favor alchemical weapons that can ignite, freeze, or electrocute their enemies and can cause persistent elemental afflictions. So, essentially, we got the tank, the warrior, the rogue, and the wizard. Roughly translated. I do like the sounds of the dancer, though. Plus, I think that's from the cover as well. Like the weapon. We get a flame grenade as well.
Time to must bust some moves, baby. <laughs> We're gonna be Beyblade, I guess. This machine that is now somehow able to speak and understand what we say to it. Oh. Yes, but it is loyal to you. Hey there, Ghosty. Welcome. That's all that matters. If it managed to escape the chateau, it could be your eyes and ears in Paris. And if, perchance, the other automats. And hey there, Necro. You won't attempt anything foolish. I cannot lose you, Gabrielle. Not now. Aegis? Madame. Uh, the king must be stopped. The very kingdom is its It own. speaks! Go and find Vaucanson at his workshop. Ni les invalides. He surely holds the secret to these tireless automats. And perhaps he will know something about the death of my son. How am I to leave the chateau grounds, madame? Go to the riverbank, at the far side of the grounds. From there you can take a boat to Paris. This game is pretty, oh my god. What if he is the one who is responsible for this unrest? What Vaucanson has done, ma chère, only Vaucanson can undo. Not much so far, Halo. Customizing the robo, yeah, essentially. All right, we're here. Movement is uh interesting. Oh, you can jump. Okay. Stamina. Ooh. Oh! Oh, that's a neat way of doing it. So, the more I attack, the more, um, like, the more the, the, the automaton heats up. That's interesting. Sekiro to Gasson! Hello there, Yakuna. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome to my little corner on Twitch. All right, so that's the heavy attack. Ooh. How your stream been? It's been all right. We've started like 16 minutes ago. <laughs> Notice how like the shield is kind of wiggling. There's a lot of movement in all of the animations. That's insane. So there is a dodge. All right. Whoa. What? I'm guessing that's to switch weapons later on, maybe. A lot of care was put into the model. Like, a lot. Yeah. Ah! Hello! Peekaboo. New souls like a wild. You can assign consumables to the quick access belt so that you can use them at any time. Okay. Oral Barret. The day Aegis was assigned to the queen as a bodyguard, she was given this metal receptacle containing a precious restorative oil. Now powered by unlimited energy, she can use it to repair damage received in battle. The barrette refills automatically when a Vestal has been activated. This assembly token. This token allows Aegis to return to the last vet. Oh, okay. So it's, it's literally Dark Souls. <laughs> okay. Uh, equip to... A, and we equip you to B. We're not going to equip you at all. It's 
Slight reduce the internal damage, frost damage caused by red. Okay. Have a good stream, homie. Thank you, Yakuna. And thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Have a good lurk. Oh my god! <laughs> That's a map! <laughs> Wow. Statistics? I'm guessing that's leveling. And equipment. Oh, okay. So you cannot unequip armor and stuff like that. Noted. We don't have a hat. Yeah, you can't unequip stuff. I would like the reason why I would I would want to unequip is to see like how the entirety of like the robot actually looks without the clothing on because like her arms and legs looks really well detailed and her back as well so I was like what does the rest of it look like all right oh there is a sprint okay Okay. Oh, chemical. Oh, okay. Ooh. Alchemical capsule. Probably looks like TOS. <laughs> what would the point of that be? though like if we really like if we take a critical look at her design right now it's very obvious that she's made with practical practicality in mind right like she, she's she was made as a bodyguard for the queen so she's made as a with practicality in mind aka weaponry um she has to be nimble and quick that's about it so anything tos would not make sense for her design <laughs> three guys over there there's apparently a um an achievement that you can do by not using the healing whatsoever apparently i don't know if i want to do that but you know <laughs> oh wow I might have to use it nonetheless. Essence of a lesser spirit. Ooh, overheating and rapid cooling. Okay what we saw before yeah actions consume endurance when just runs out of endurance her gears overheat and she can no longer perform the following actions attack jump dodge and sprint when overheated you can trigger rapid cooling triangle which can instantly restore an amount of endurance depending on your timing however this inflicts a certain amount of frost damage as shown by the following gauge using this too soon after overheating will prolong the overheating oh I need to test that out. Come on. Ah. That's a neat mechanic, actually. So it's about timing. Interesting. A little bit like Bloodborne, except in Bloodborne you had to attack uh, enemies to get your health back. Here you can get your stamina back by timing a button prompt. That's interesting. I dig it. It's it's interesting so far. Hello, Mr. Robot. I yank this at you. Oh, 
Uh oh. There are mid air attacks? <laughs> what? Interesting. Maybe not on the first playthrough. Maybe not. I'm very close to dying. The running animation seems a bit, um, slow. A little bit slow, a little bit floaty, maybe. Like, the controls is very snappy, I will say that. But her movement speed and how, like, the running animation works seems a bit slow to me. Is that just me, or...? Nah. It does look a bit weird. Yeah. Hurt. Oh. Interesting. Okay. There are sneak attacks. What? <laughs> okay, interesting. <laughs> I didn't expect that. Looks like she could be faster. I mean, you can sprint. See, that, that seems more akin to, like, how fast she should be. It's weird. I don't know. There's no sneaking ability. Activating Vestals. There's a checkpoint, which can be repaired if she breaks. She can upgrade her attributes with Anima Essence, upgrade equipment, and obtain equipment. Ah, okay. I've got a question for you. How many languages can you speak? I am bilingual in the sense that I know two languages, English and my native language. Oh, ew. Spider legs? Ew, what the? No, ew. <laughs> no. <laughs> Boutique. Ordinary or vile. Slow acting alchemical distillate. So that's a slow. So that's a gradual heal. Okay. This cobblestone is thrown in enemies. Order attention. Uh, pebble, essentially. Uh. The most challenging of the development has been several cases of Tomer destroying themselves in their own fulmination attacks. So the development of this. Consolidating elixir, which acts as an antidote. So it's it's an antidote. It's against poison, essentially. Flame resistance, frost resistance, uh, thunder resistance, I guess. Ah, here we go. Okay. I can't buy anything. <laughs> Can I upgrade anything? No. Everything is expensive. Lightning and the thunder. Yes. Can you teach me one sentence in your native language, please? Um, shit. Uh, I got no clue. There we go. 
How do you say I love you in your native language? <laughs> That's a specific one. <laughs> no! <laughs> Why do you want to learn that in <laughs> They're just trying to get you to confess. Oh, shit. You're right, Meiji. You almost had it. Do it. <laughs> uh oh. Give me just a second there. Ooh. <sighs> okay. How do you say I love you in Danish? Ja, elf kan die. I hate I, I hate I hate it. I hate speaking my own language. Like specifically on here. Where did she go? <laughs> Or while I didn't even have to buy it, I could just find it. Okay, clip time. I'm gonna delete that clip. Okay. Sounds lovely. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's a very uh, parasocial kind of a, like relationship we have for him. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know you personally. So I can't really say I have those kind of feelings for you. I'm sure, oh my good lord. That's a big boy. What was the other direction? Very interesting mechanic, actually. Oh shit, he saw me. Hmm. I am legitimately removing that clip. When I'm done streaming. <laughs> A symbol I love you can make someone's day, you know. Sure, but I also think that the phrase I love you is a very intimate phrase. That should not be, uh, you know, handed out all willy-nilly. That's a personal opinion. That ah, shit, he saw me. Hello. Oh, fuck. I really have to get used to that. Downloaded MIDI for the archives. Please don't do that. I got a hat. And more grenades. Are we just explosive grenades? Okay. Put on the hat. Oh my god, I look absolutely gorgeous. We have to go this way. But 
I look now. I got to go get ready. Sure thing, Midgey. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. You need a tool to break this. I see. The boss quest. I need to learn how to get closer without alerting them at this point. They do like to ambush you, I've noticed. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Whoa! They are dead soldiers, oh my goodness. Some granite. One longevity module. You've obtained a new model module. You can assign it on the mo module slot. The same level from the mo okay. <laughs> slightly reduces the internal damage. Frost damage caused by rapid cooling increases health. It's essentially the same. I had a feeling. I had a feeling. That looked a bit suspicious. Mm, right. Ordinary oil. Flame resistance. Uh, sure, why not? Is this game free? No, fame. This is a fully priced uh, video game. It has a triple A uh, title uh, price tag to it. The Swiss Guard, killed by the automats that replaced them. Ew. I hear it. There it is. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, that's a boss. It's a very interesting looking boss. Hello. He has friends. Oh, ah. Oui. Oh, come on. He's almost dead, and so am I. There we go, got him. I need a better weapon, I think. $60? Yes, it is. It's not a boss. It's an unstable answer. <laughs> right. I'm sorry, Coolie. Right. How could I be so blind? A module key. I see. You've obtained a module key. 
Uh, several slots for modules that augment their stats and alter their behaviors. The slots have levels and allow executors to fit increasingly powerful modules. To unlock a slot with the module key you have obtained, go to the upgrades menu. At a vestal. Uh -huh. Okay. Capitan de Gros! Governor de Vrafri confirms the new command was given to replace your company with a detachment of automats. I therefore urge you until further notice. <laughs> I don't know what the, the accent this is. To keep your distance from these machines and to inform me of any signs of hostility. Do not engage unless Her Majesty the Queen is in danger. Reinforcements are on route. <laughs> Lieutenant Colonel the Bachman. Second in command of the place the Saint Cloud. Okay. Sure. Alright. Sit down on the creepy spider legs. Uh, upgrade. Oh, I see. Okay. Affliction multiplier. Critical hit. Okay. Hey there, Fluffy. How are you doing? Let's go with a little bit more damage. You need three keys, apparently. I see. Oh, you can upgrade it. Okay. Oh, I see. So you can upgrade that as well. Okay. The boutique. Anything of node that I can buy or sell? Really doesn't look like it. This artificial alchemical essence in the form of a bomb provides a tiny amount of anima in essence. Very good, Dark Necromancer. Okay. Alright. Okay. It's very, uh... Oh! Right, they, re they probably respawn. For me, sitting at that thing, I, f I forget. It it's a Souls-like, right. I'm an idiot. Insulation elixir, okay. Yeah, he's over there. Hello. It's a shield musket. A hand cannon of alchemical affliction. You have acquired a hand cannon. Just like her enemy's weapons, Aegis' own weapons will cause al uh, alchemical damage. Flame, frost, and fulmination. Fulmination. When she uses alchemical capsules for each such attack. Uh, extinguish fire faster by dodging? Okay. Fall faster by attacking. Stop electrocution by using the insulation elixir. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh my god! <laughs> God damn! <laughs> okay. <laughs> it 
Time to test it. Hello, good sir. Interesting. Okay. The lantern. Blocked. Oh, hello. That's a big boy down there. have to get used to, to uh, just switching weapons on the fly, it seems. That hand cannon is really useful in uh, freezing them. Ooh, we got new clothes! Oh my god, fashion! Mm. We do get more endurance, but not by a lot. Get a shitload of armor, though. Let's stick with stats for now. We can always go back to fashion later. What is that? Whatever it is, it's dead. <laughs> I need to be careful with the amount of bullets I'm using by the looks of things. I don't know how to get that back. Yet, at least. Gun go brr. <laughs> yep. Nemesis Claws. Finding one's way. You have acquired a compass. You can assign a compass to the quick access belt. You can use it at any time to see your way to your destination. Oh. Oh, shame. Actually, we'll put that there. Put you there, and that seems fine, yeah. The riverbank is just beyond this wood. Okay. Here's some parkour! Oh my god! She's a parkour lady. I think. Maybe. Hmm. What is, huh? No, there has to be a reason. Oh, there's an item there. Uh, 
Uh, com uh, comrades, in the name of the nation, our honor demands that we stop our work. The king threatens to send his foreign regime, or regiments, into the capital. Shall we continue to build a vain lantern while our brothers are slothers for four leagues from St. Cloud? The time has come to put down our tools and take up arms to Paris. Equality or death. Freedom will recognize its own. You see. So this is doing the French Revolution. Is there really nothing? There's a chest up there. How do you get up there? How do you get up there? There's a chest up there. Do I need like a tool or something? Like... Great, there's fall damage. Oh! Ah, oh, well. Yes! We shall use it. Upgrades. Let's see what should we upgrade further. Any parry that is timed just right reverses the effect of the enemy's attack and deals physical damage. Huh. Let's go with another one in power. Alright, I keep forgetting I have a shield. So, let's try out these Nemesis Claws. Oh god. Okay. So that has a parry move. Time to test it! Hey there, Supreme. How are you doing, buddy? Uh, Bloodborne 2. <laughs> I'm gonna keep calling it that. Tried the uh, the parry yet, but that's that French Souls game I've been hearing about. Yep. A module key. Uh, 
Okay, uh, parrying is a little more difficult than I thought it was going to be. Shit. Combat seems pretty stylish, and I like that. Yeah! The, like, idle, normal running animation could use some work. It feels really slow. Combination resistance, we have to go that way. Hello? Ooh, there we go. Oh god. That's something I really have to get used to. Falchion and Saber. Uh, oh my god. Okay, uh, by using the sword and the falchion uh, in combination, Aegis can perform a spinning attack that delivers a flurry of hits. Oh, that uses up all... See, I see. Okay. Oh. Well, shit, I died. <laughs> Okay. Uh, repair the last vessel she visited. All animals can remain in the place she broke. If it breaks again, after returning, they disappear. Okay, can be used to improve. Yeah, okay. Pretty straightforward stuff. Not a fan of this weapon here, actually. I prefer the Nemesis Claw so far a bit more. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Got our essence back. That is blocked. Lots of enemies in there. <laughs> Look how he's vibing. <laughs> no? Okay. He's having a good time? Yes. Pulling the oil barrette. Oh, I see. Take the boat to Paris. This seems like a boss battle. Yeah, I have a feeling this is a boss battle. The 
this boat will take me to Paris. Yeah. Big boy! Okay, no, it doesn't. <laughs> Dude, sucker punched me. Oh, God. How am I supposed to avoid that? Okay, uh, pop that. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Interesting. Oh. Great. Okay, not really too keen on seeing what that ability does to me, so... Oh, he parried me there! Lightning ram. Oh, not a fan of that. Not taking any chances when I'm that close. Oh, come on! I was that close. Is dodging not available in this game? It is. You just don't get any iframes from it. So it's just about timing your dodging correctly. And near the boys. <sighs> oh, fuck. 
Ow, fuck. Travel to Paris. In Bloodborne, we got to experience living in London. Now we have to experience living in France. Truly are some twisted people for coming up with this. <laughs> cheese? I don't want a cheese stuff. I gotta get good at this game, and I did. I beat him. By becoming better. I never said you had the cheese, I just said cheese. Ah, that is good food. So many doors are blocked. All right. The phone. Off we go. That sounds delicious, Redacted. Now off into the true hell, buddy. <laughs> the game is really pretty. I gotta give it that. I say yes, the texture of the ground hasn't loaded at all. <laughs> what is... <laughs> Dad, this does not look finished. What? It wasn't like this before. I give the game a compliment and that shit happens, okay. This does not look right. <laughs> Frost grenade. Mobilization. Uh, just fill the enemy temporarily really mobilized, leaving them open to critical hits. Yeah, okay. I learned that on the boss. <laughs> right. <laughs> right, Supreme. I think that was Warhammer, Space Marine. My older brother went to France around Christmas a couple of years ago. He went there in hopes of getting a job as a cook. Was rejected, spent the remaining time he had there before coming home to Italy by visiting Paris. And getting told off or ignored by locals for not speaking French when asking directions and to see stuff. Wow. That, yeah, ow, okay. That sounds a bit rude. <laughs> Do 
the boutique. Uh, what do you have? Ooh, frosted fans. Hello. <laughs> Doesn't look that great. New pants. Oh my god. And a hood. And some boots. Some module and a key. A module key. Time to sell some things. That's 250 from that. Okay. What happens if I use it then? How much do I get for that? Oh. I, I just I just get get it. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I should just sell it then. Kill a doll dress of my favorite. Oh, I have three keys in total. Okay. Oh, great. It's probably better if I unlock. There we go. Weapons. Grab that. And. Let's put something into health. Might be a good idea. Okay, and then modules. Longevity. Oh, I need to level up one of the slots to be able to use the new one. Increases balance during charged attacks. I see. Okay. Liz Invalid. There's nothing to save, apparently. Reason he went to France in the first place uh, was to get a job at an Italian restaurant. What's even more rude was his experience at the restaurant where he witnessed locals ask for spaghetti alla caponada, a traditional Italian dish, but demanding something that is an insult. Demanding that is an insult to Italian cuisine. Really? But. If it's a traditional Italian dish, why is it an insult to ask that from an Italian, you know, restaurant? I'm sorry, but like, to me, that seems kind of like weird to get insulted over that. No one else would be able to know how to make it the best kind than, you know, Italians. Oh, it's a dog! Picked up a water flask. Oh my god! Ow. I don't know what you use the water flask for. 
insult was that they wanted the dish, uh, which was spaghetti made with different condiments rather than what a la caponada would normally have. I see. Oh my god. God, that's that's scary. <laughs> the ground texture is really like annoying me. I got to be honest. the other side of the door oh and i can unlock it Sinking. Good thing I got a water bottle. Water, see what play. Here is something to quench your thirst. Praise be to God. Bless you, whoever you are. Take this for your trouble. Okay. Why do they sound British when they're supposed to be French? <laughs> I mean, at that point, I don't think, like, they meant it as a malicious thing. I think that they should just have been more clear to the cook what kind of carbonara they wanted. Customer was rude about it. Okay. Yeah, I have heard that uh, France isn't really the most friendliest of places to visit. Like they really, apparently, they really don't like uh, foreigners from what I've been told. Got all these freaking grenades, like... grenade, frost grenades, explosive grenades. Petrification grenade. And fulmination resistance. There we go. Grenade! Did 
this game is out? Yeah, it is me. Just the ground texture is kind of annoying me, but I can't really do anything about it. <laughs> if you don't like a dish, maybe uh, just don't order it next time. Hi. Oh, hey, Miji. I thought you were at work. The fuck is that? <laughs> he walks kind of funny. Grenade! He didn't like that. Grenade! 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 <laughs> He's dead. I had to get ready for work, not leaving yet. Ah. That ground suck. Yeah, I know. I don't know how to fix it, really. Like, because graphic settings are. Oh, 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 my God. The frame rate. I mean, that fixed the ground, but oh my god. Wow. Really? That's the difference? Wait, no. Huh. I don't know, man. A lot of dead people. Granite. Flame grenade. I hear a big boy. Great. He has dogs with him. Grenade! Grenade! Do I have any kind of grenades? I have flame grenades. Alright, I uh, grenade! I missed grenade! I missed again. Fuck. Oh shit. Come on. Come on. Alright, it's time to see what this boy is up to. Hello! Oh, okay. This game is pretty offensive. Look, it literally objectifies a female characters. She's a doll automaton-like thing or object if you will. How can you play this? Minus 10 brownie points. Oh my god. Oh my god, I might die to this thing. What am I doing? I got a gun! I need to use my gun more! <laughs> It's an azotosa, so it has some level of smart. <laughs> what of healing items? A fire chain. Hello? Is that a weapon? It is. What is this? When the chain weapon is placed in contact with the ground, Aegis summons a... Thonian Inferno that engulfs the weapon and enables fire damage. Okay.
there's literally swords in the game and you use claws? Yeah. Minus five brownie points. Well, Medias, I'm sorry to say, but if you're such a pleb, you need a sword to feel threatening and not just having claws on you, you're doing something wrong. There's some range to this thing. What did you say? <laughs> this is streamer abuse. <laughs> claws are better than... Uh, um, uh, claws are better than better swords sometimes. What? Why not just be a chad and use bare fists? See, that's another thing. I feel like I've skipped a lot. Uh-oh. Take the thing. Ah, uh, there's a door. What if a katana appears? We're in France! I don't think a katana is gonna show up. Oh god. I need to be careful. I'm almost dead. I will only be able to locate Monsieur de Vauconson's workshop from an elevated position. Her lips moves. Did you see that, chat? Her freaking lips move. You know what that means? That means that this is automatically better than any FromSoft game. I don't know. I'm not much of a fan for this thing here. I like the range of it, but... The thing is, I would love to use these weapons again. Because I like the, the combo it has. But the shield isn't a parry. Hon 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 to desuka. Ah, uh, screw it. We've explored everywhere else, I think. We've been here. We went through the door. Oh, I didn't go down here, I think, did I? Oh, I did. Ride or die. <laughs> All right. Upgrade. See, that's the thing. I want to use the armored fans more, but... If it had like a parry move. Ow! Here's your drink. Hallows underscore I work. gifted a tier one sub to your underscore boy underscore redacted. They have given 2,939 gift subs in the channel. Can you customize this lady's looks, by the way? Uh, at the beginning you can, yes. The rest is just equipment. I mean, I guess I could. I guess I could uh, upgrade it. I need... I need more health is what I need. Uh, do I want to upgrade it though? Under attack, yeah. Because 
the counter attack is really useful if um if I nail it. I should stop at uh, 2,999. Ace would love that. Ace would love if I stop now. Yeah, I would love if you just stop, period. Just, just, you know what? Halo, if you reach 2,999 subs, uh, just, just stop there. Don't ever gift again. Keep that number. Keep that number. And don't ever gift subs on this channel again. I don't know, man. I don't know if I want to upgrade. Ow! There's a drink. Sun underscore rider 09 gifted a tier one sub to Supreme Memo 07. They have given 19 gift subs in the channel. Thanks. Let's put... Okay. Has enemies respawned? Yes, they have. Let's test out this shield here. I don't know, man. Because I can't really... I can't, like, pull out the, sh the shield uh, mid-combo. Oh, wait, no, I can. You respawn of those funky chairs when you die? Yes. No sound? What? Is there no game sound? Throwables make no sound for us when we donate. What? What? Don't tell me there's more shit that's... Oh. Uh, why? Why? Okay, give me... So if this game had a meme name, would it be Final French Souls Born Automata? I see... What about TTS? Do you hear that? Do you hear the TTS at all? Oh. We heard that? Okay. That's something at least.
Oh no, the immersion. <laughs> there we go. Okay, chat. Do me a favor. Throw something in my face. Just something. Something that has sound. Thank you. Was there anything at all? Okay, uh, <laughs> all right, um, uh, oh, okay, okay, um. <laughs> Freaking. Okay, hold on here. Uh. <laughs> oh. Ain't that lovely? Why? The wonderful world of scuff. You know damn right that's how it is here. I don't understand. I don't understand. Um, okay. I think, I think I got it. I think perhaps okay. <clears throat> Okay. Uh, 
All right, chat, try now. Fucking throw shit at me right now. Come on. Just, just, uh, mm. Oh, did it come back? All right, I fixed it. Look at me being a freaking mechanic of my own damn ship. Um, thanks. Okay, let's let's move on. Guys, like, I prefer the, um, the parrying more than the blocking. Ow! Dicks? Like, if I sit down real quick here. Yeah, this one is a lot more responsive. Oh, okay. Come here, bitch! I just didn't hit me, period. Like, <laughs> all right, let's try up against this big boy. just me right like the, the, it does seem like the uh the parry is more responsive lever action rifle that can transform into two-handed scythe i mean are you talking about ruby <laughs> the, 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 it sounds eerily like ruby <laughs> And if I'm going to be completely honest with you, uh, Redacted, I think it's a stupid weapon. Mainly because it's a scythe. The bold action, uh, the lever action rifle, that's a good weapon. But turning it into a scythe, I think that's a stupid thing. Because, you know, the thing about scythes is they look cool, but they're really shit as weapons. Like, they're not good weapons, period. Try the armored fans again. Do you even care about it? You wanted uh, me to rate the, the weapon concept. I gave you a rating. I think it's bad. Hmm. 
I'll stick with dual revolvers as my favorite choice of weapons. Here's a weapon design for, uh, concept for you all. Like a trick weapon, right? I like revolvers. I like revolvers a lot. Right? So, what if we took two revolvers, but you combine them and it turns into a blunderbuss? <laughs> I don't know how mechanically that would work, but think about it. <laughs> or even better. Sounds like that uh, that one gun in death loop that one two pistols combining into an SMG. Ah. Could also, if we could also make it so that like, it would be two pi two revolvers, two pistols, right? But they have blades, like, fitted onto them, and then you can combine them into like, I don't know, like, a weird spear. Wah! <laughs> <laughs> The Glockinator. <laughs> mm, maybe? Maybe. Maybe I just need to get the timing down. You know what? I'm going to upgrade the uh, the fans. I'm going to upgrade the fans and um and see how they work. So we're going to go here, upgrade the weapon. All right. And then More power. Go to the boutique. Sell. Sell all of those. Like to purchase. Upgrades. Still can't. Oh, God. I'm so close, though. All right, boys. Let's continue. Oh, hello. You, you wanna go, dude? Bro's friggin' dead. <laughs> Four barrel blunderbuss. That sounds extremely impractical. I think if you shot all three of those barrels, you would never be able to stand up straight or your arms would straight up break from the uh, from the recoil. You wanna go, bitch? Shit. I need to learn to block. Ooh, okay. Maybe not block everything.
like, see, the thing is, when it comes to weapons, uh, and me, right? Um, I used to just, like, really, obs like, over-the-top weapons. I, I used to love those kinds of designs. But as I grew older and I played a lot of video games, I saw a lot of, um, movies and series and stuff like that, I started enjoying, like, practical weapons a lot more in any setting. I don't know why. Fare thee well, noble chatters and streamers. Sure thing, Midgey. Thank you for hanging out with us. It has been a pleasure. And have a good day at work. Persons of a valiant spirit. Oh, he was so valiant. He valiantly defended himself until he died. <laughs> That's why I like big and solid strikers and easy to use armor. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> TABG is a game made by God himself during that drunken coding rampage. In the Unity game engine, the Russian match. <laughs> uh, I need to bring you guys over here so I can actually see you better. I don't know, man. I once loved the idea of having a hidden blade on the pummel of a claymore sword, but it wouldn't really be practical. Yeah, no, that's it's easier for you to stab yourself at that point. I would agree. That doesn't really sound all that practical. You'd stab yourself a lot quicker than you would stab someone else. It sounds cool, but, you know. But then again, the hidden blade as well. That's also not a very practical weapon. Because, you know, you have to cut off your own finger to use it correctly. And even then, you can still slit your other fingers because it's so close to your hand still. What are you looking for there, Ace? I'm just exploring, see if I can find any hidden items. I'm not really looking for anything in particular. There's another spear dude up there. This place is big and open, I don't like this. What the fuck? Oh. Someone's coming. Oh no, no. Another one of those evil machines. Okay, it's just about timing when to block at that point. People are party, Louis, King Franz, Nerd, blah blah blah, just in the news, something we were saying. What is to ensure the safety of his separatists, his majesty has decreed the population must remain in their homes until further notice. Hello? Do not fear. I mean you no harm. Ah! 
can speak too. <laughs> Get out of here, you damn pile of scrap metal. Oh. Have you not seen what I've done to these automats? Worse than dogs at each other's throats. It's almost as if everyone has decided to kill each other before the sun comes up. What happened in this Faubourg? The king kept his word. His automats were merciless. If only we'd known what his new army was made of, we'd have all stayed home just... During the French Revolution, I think, Ryder. He killed his family in his court of murderers. Monsieur. Allez, vous en! Okay. Can't get to that. Okay. We can jump down there. There's another big boy. Oh, hello. The guillotines, probably in the inner city. Uh oh. Excuse me? You're just gonna ignore me? Oh, Christ. Okay, so blocking those guys is not a good idea. There's a demo out of the new Neo Bird in China game. Have you tried it? Uh, no. Which one? <laughs> Oolong Dynasty? I have no idea what that is. The one I'm really interested in is the one, uh, the last Ronin warrior or whatever the hell it's called. Uh, where you play as like a Ronin where the English has arrived in, in Japan or some shit like that. Hey, module key. Nice. A tribute to Marquis de la Fayette. Uh, by Monsieur Dick. <laughs> to the tune of Avec Légier dans le village. When Lafayette commands, we answer as one aloud. All of Paris calls for him, and everyone si sings out. His name alone is worth a dozen, and if some danger were to call, with the hero of our gates, how could we fear at all? I see. 
The last one is its name, I believe. Mm -hmm. oh. I need a tool. Shit. That thing has a flaming... You will never get to use it against me! Ha ha ha! According to the average British man, being British is all about driving a German car to an Irish-themed pub to drink Belgian beer and then going home buying an Indian takeaway to sit on a Swedish sofa in front of a Japanese television to watch American shows and all the while being suspicious of anything foreign. I mean, yeah, that sounds about the majority of the entire world, to be honest. <laughs> Not just British. <laughs> and old in heavy fire. Ah! Oh, I'm dead. Fuck. I wasn't paying attention. No, you know what? We're gonna save here. We'll save here. I think this is a good uh, spot to, uh, to stop. Now, the reason why I'm stopping now is quite simple. I have plans tomorrow, and I need to go to bed early. <laughs> oh, the horror. <laughs> so, thank you, everyone, for being here. I appreciate it. Thank you for all the gifted subs from Halo and Sun and Halo. Thank you. And the resub from Ranger as well. Thank you. I appreciate it. And hopefully I will see you guys again next time. When next time is, I do not know. This entire weekend is going to be very busy for me. I'll see what happens. But until next time, I hope you all will have a great weekend. And a great week. Bye. By the way, I love you all. You're so great. You're amazing. And you guys are doing great. I'm so proud of you all. Okay, bye.